Welcome to Politics as Usual. Trump derangement syndrome has infected Ohio's 9th congressional district race. Recently, the two current Republican primary candidates had to warp honesty in order to be worthy of being the cult's nominee to try and knock off 40 plus year incumbent Democrat Representative Marcy Kaptur. This Business Insider article from a week and a half ago summarizes as follows. With the headline, Ohio Republicans are coalescing behind one of the worst performing candidates of the 2022 midterms after his main GOP opponent trashed Trump. Craig Rydell, the leading GOP candidate in a competitive Ohio district, recently trashed Trump. It's already cost him support from fellow Republicans and boosted his primary foe, J.R. Majewski. Majewski was the party's 2022 nominee and lost by 13 points after lying about his military service. So this infliction, primarily attributed to Democrats who can't look past Comrade Trump's illegal actions, has now been proven to cross party lines and add another layer of mental illness to a Republican party already reeling from severe functional impairment. Um, our conference has a responsibility to the American people, and this conference is absolutely broken. Um, it's outrageous. We have we have serious issues. I'll close with evidence of this. Rydell, the once honest candidate, is running ads in Florida in Trump's broadcast market, which is over 1,200 miles from his district and voters, evidently to try to get in the naked emperor's good standing. J.R. Majewski, he acts like a tough guy who always backs President Trump, except when he's getting crushed by liberal Marcy Kaptur and calling Trump an idiot. That's right. J.R. Majewski called Trump an idiot to establishment. Trump is an idiot to establishment. I can't stand elitists. President Trump needs loyal winners, not backstabbing losers who call him an idiot, like J.R. Majewski. I'm Craig Riedel, and I approve this message. No further proof of derangement required. I'm going to close with a limerick. Thank you for watching, and Merry Christmas. Ohio Trump swabs have feet held to fire. One for being honest, one a liar. Is clear which aligned with Trump, the one with the bullshit dump. Both now members of their party's cult choir. Politics as usual, new video every Sunday. Please subscribe and share. Thank you for watching.